What is crack ass crack girl here? And here with the baby. I'm also recording. She has a little Snapchat glasses, so we're gonna see if these things are still relevant or not. But today, guys, right now we are in California Adventure Park, DCA. So here we go. We are back. We are definitely back. I do want to give a shout out to my sub out there, guys, on Twitch, who made this day possible. We actually bought the ticket today, so today is being paid for. So I really, truly appreciate it. Thank you very much for buying our tickets. But yeah, we're here on another day. So Evo, baby wants to go on Nader's over here. We do have Nader outside as well. Yeah. There you go, first is first. Go a little meter ride. Why ain't too bad. What's your, what's your thoughts on meter? Yeah? Yeah, I'm getting the first ride. Come soon. The first ride? How'd you think? Huh? Fun times? Yes. Yeah. Alright, so we're at uh, Made it right for the first one here. Careful adventure. It was fun. It's been a while. But yeah, nice and quick. Now we're moving. We're moving pretty quick. You get to see Nader out today. But now we're moving on to the next ride. Another reason why I have Evil Baby here with me is because she's my. She She'll take photos. She loves to take some photos. And she loves all the rides. So all the rides, I won't be passing anything. We're gonna try to do as much as we can. Right now, Radio Springs is only a 10 minute wait. So we're doing this. Well, it's been a year for Evil Baby. For me, I was here like a week ago. But Evil Baby has been on here. Are you excited to get on this? Yeah. yeah? So there we go. So hopefully we get uh, fun. I had fun last time. So let's go, let's do this again. Take two. Oh God, the little Evil Baby drive. No. No! Oh no! Oh, yeah. Here we go. Let's do this. coming on right here at Disneyland is they have sanitized machines every time you exit the ride. They don't really wipe. I haven't, for my person, I've not seen them wipe any of the rides before you get on. I haven't seen them like wipe down every time the other person comes on. Like Universal and National Mountain, they both wipe down the ride every time people came in. Disneyland, I have not seen that yet. But they do have sanitizer machines after you get off the ride. What's your thought, Dr. Bean? A year of being a radio screen. Oh, that was awesome. Was it? Yeah. Where's your pair of cards? When we were going down, we actually won. We won this time. Yeah. From that ride to this ride. Now we're jumping into Luigi's. We gotta get ready to get out of Luigi's. Are you excited for Luigi's? Yeah. Yeah. It's really bright. It is bright. Bright and hot. It's gonna be a hot day. today. I don't know why I told her not to wear a lot of things, but no. I don't have anything else to wear. Don't listen to that. But that's not the way. You know how many evil baby and crash shirts she has? Maybe someday when I'm grown older. I can see it all clear from above. Looking back on it all. Maybe I can see what was broken. Here, 
at Disneyland is everything is either mobile or cashless. So make sure you guys know that. Everything has a, a QR code, you gotta scan, and that's how you guys order your food here. So here's something good to know that Disney does have. If you guys have the fuel rods, you can use your fuel rods here. And they don't charge. Only the one-time fee, but if you already have one, they don't so we go. We're gonna put our, our empty rod in here. And we should get ours coming out right now. Oh, look at that. Universal Studios charges $3. Disney, still free. All right, taking a quick break, getting um, some food here at Flo's Cafe. Very good. Yo, baby, you got the cheeseburger. I got the cheeseburger. Something special, or something simple, actually. Pickles. You like the pickles here? Pickles are actually really good. But yeah, Radio Springs, look at this. Food, excellent view. Come on, Radio Springs. You can't go wrong with it. I have to say, the food here at Flo's Cafe, it's much more meatier, better tasting than Galactic Grill, Grill in Disneyland. What a difference. Oh my god. This is actually really good. You guys haven't tried here at Flo's Cafe? Very good. Did you know when in DCA, when you walk on this bridge, if you stand still, it's gonna give you a resemble, you feel a little ricocheted, feel, feel it moving? Because it's supposed to give us like a simulation of an earthquake, like a three point earthquake. So if you stand still on this bridge, you can feel this bridge shake, yeah. But you have to stand completely still. This is like California here, so it's supposed to give you like a, a, a simulation of a three point something earthquake. But you can feel it. You can feel it move. It's crazy. A lot of people don't realize it. People, people just walk over this bridge and they don't realize they're actually walking over a shaky bridge. A little tip that a lot of people don't know about that. So Max is out today. Look at that. Max. Now Evil Baby watches the Goofy movie tons of times. And there's Max, her idol. She'll say, Max. No. They got Judy Howe here from Zootopia. So right now they're still testing uh, the rapids here. They're not open. I heard May 7th though, they're supposed to be open. The evil baby wants to get on to Little Mermaid. So here we go. Little Mermaid it is. So a major tip here, now that it's keep hot in California, uh, we're not used to the mask out here and it's really heat. The Little Mermaid ride is a perfect ride to go on to because it's, it's slow, it's dark, and it's cold in there, and it's cool. And the lines are never long. Right now the lines are, it's pretty much a walk-in. So, perfect tip. If you guys ever get overheated, Little Mermaid in DCA is a place to go because it's gonna cool down really quick. Okay. Coco's inside. So, Coco is coming in. That's awesome. That's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> so even baby just got off of uh, silly symphony swings how was it it was fun i saw you in your silly poses out there i think you're peter pan no i saw you out there posing and flying and <laughs> like superman exactly so yeah jesse out here and this side of the park look at that you want to take a picture of jesse no, <laughs> no? all right there you go evil baby's going on there i would have gone on here but she went on the swinging one i can't do swinging that hot oh no i can't i i just can't it's just not gonna work for me <laughs> big tip here in dca is come to dca first if you have like a, a park hopping pass you have to choose either disneyland or dca choose dca dca you're not gonna have the crowd like literally it's like a five minute wait for every pretty much every ride you go on Credit Coaster was five minutes. Uh, Soarin' five minutes. Radio Springs was 10 minutes. 10 minutes for Radio Springs? And I say definitely do DCA, and then with your other one, go to uh, Disneyland. Unless you like Disneyland more, but I'm just telling you guys, one of the biggest tips, DCA, Park Hopper first, then Disney. You get so there are a lot of like snack carts everywhere. Of course, um, the Yum Yum and Jack's cookies are not here. But are you pretty much just getting a popcorn and candy? I say stay, um, stay hydrated. You do have water. There is no water fill stations here, so bring your own water containers and DCA. But in Disneyland, there is water refill stations. Now the lap lounge over there is actually a really cool place to eat. The food is decent, but once again, overpriced drinks, overpriced food, 
So you're a parent like me, pimping on a budget, then that place there, it's cool to visit, but I wouldn't go there every visit. Because if you have kids, that's gonna be very really expensive to feed all your kids. Evil baby just broke credit coaster. How was credit coaster? That was so fun! Was it? Yeah. I saw you with your eyes closed. I filmed you recording by. <laughs> How was it? That was really fun. Was it yeah. fast? Huh? Was it fast? Yes. Yeah? Yeah. Faster than Magic Mountain? No. No? no. Magic Mountain still faster? Yeah. See, I'm not getting records. All the YouTubers out there who keep saying that this place is the best place ever and you do this and do that. Like I said, if you're in the budget, yes. But if not, no. Don't try it. So this is rare. Seeing Snow White and Dopey, that is totally rare. Alright, so before we leave the park, what's the run we're going to get on right now? Soren. Soren. Soren of the Road, which is... I always think Soren of the Road is much better than Soren over California. I've been everywhere in California, so I kind of like been to those areas. Why didn't they make a Soren over Disneyland? I know, that'd be kind of crazy. And then they just see us riding <laughs> us. Right? Maybe. But Soren over California is like where my son Logan loves to see. So Soren of the Road, I like it much better. You get Siku things, uh, you get to see Moana, you get to see Aladdin. Uh, it's actually really cool, I don't know. Mulan. Mulan, all right, there you go. All different places. So we did do quite a few stuff here today, right? Yeah. We went on a lot of things, a lot of, she went on Credit Coaster, which she's been wanting to go to for a long time. The the, uh, the first wheel, something she wanted to do for a very long time. But we're kind of like on a, on a time budget because now we can go to Disney and Disney's minimum, so we got five hours to go enjoy as much as we can at Disney. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching, I truly appreciate it. Thanks for the donation. Thanks for buying us our tickets. We really, really... We Disneyland. Yes. We truly appreciate you guys buying the tickets. You guys are awesome. You guys are amazing. Thank you very much. You have no idea how thankful we are for you buying a ticket. And for the donation for our drink and ice cream. They were yummy. Okay, okay, we say goodbye to Disney California Adventure. Bye. And now we're heading over to Disneyland.